because of their training together. How much will he know? And will he have a strategy that can deal with the awkward movement, footwork, and sniper-like attack of Lyoto Machida? Lyoto Machida, one of nine Brazilians to have won a UFC title, looking to start his middleweight run here tonight. We get you the Bud Light Tale to take for our five-round middleweight main event between the 35-year-olds Lyoto Machida and Mark Munoz, a one-inch height advantage for the former light heavyweight champion. He also enters the octagon with a two-inch reach advantage over the Filipino wrecking machine, Mark Munoz. To get us started for the main event is Bruce Buck. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. Our three judges scoring this contest at octagon side are Howard Hughes, Andy Roberts, and Chris Watts. When the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Leon Roberts. Now, live from Manchester, England, it's time! Five rounds in the UFC middleweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. A mixed martial artist, holding a professional record, 13 wins, 3 losses. Standing 6 feet tall, weighing in at 186 pounds, 13.3 kilos. Fighting out of Lake Forest, California, by way of Vallejo, California, USA, Mark, the Filipino Rocky Machine. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. A karate fighter, holding a professional record. 19 wins, 4 losses. He stands 6 feet 1 inch tall, weighing in at 185 pounds, 13.2 kilos. Fighting at Los Angeles, California, USA, by way of Bella, Brazil. He is the former UFC light heavyweight champion, Lee. The Dragon Machina! Gentlemen, you both know the rules, you both know what I expect. Protect yourselves at all times, obey my instruction at all times. If I ask you to break, I expect a good, clean break. Fight clean, fight hard, and fight fair. Touch gloves, back to your corners. So from the gym in Los Angeles, California, to the big time inside the octagon here in Manchester, England. Mark Munoz taking on the former champion at 205 pounds, Lyoto the Dragon Machida. Now just seconds away from his UFC middleweight debut. Okay, first round, you ready to fight? You ready to fight? Bring it on, come on. The fight clock is brought to you by Geico. 15 minutes could save you 15% or more on car insurance. Munoz was able to bring in a few karate guys late in his training camp, but of course didn't have the benefit of having guys to simulate Machida's style for the bulk of his camp. Machida's not just a karate guy, but is very, very high level with his karate. Competed in many karate tournaments before he became an MMA fighter. And as we mentioned before, has other skills as well. Black belt in Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu and has a lot of sumo experience, which actually he utilizes to throw guys off balance and uses hips to stop takedowns. Also throws a lot of weird techniques the guys aren't anticipating, like trips that go along with punches and kicks in combination form. Very unique approach. Yeah, best of luck finding a guy to try to simulate the cheating training. And no surprise, a little bit of a feeling out process here early. Another factor that may play in this fight is that only one guy has been five rounds. That is Lyoto Machida. And it was a very disputed decision that he won against Mauricio Shogun Hula to defend his light heavyweight title. That's the only time he's ever been five rounds. And Munoz has never competed in the fourth or fifth round in his career in the UFC. 
Nice body kick there by Machida. And as you saw there about 30 seconds ago, Munoz will be very careful when he tries to change levels and go for that takedown. Well, one of the things about training with a guy as opposed to fighting a guy is that when you train and you're sparring, you don't hit 100%. Right. pull back a little bit. That's how you, you retain sparring partners. You, you help each other. You're, you're working on your timing, your distancing, and the ability to close that distance and land shots. You're not trying to knock each other out unless you're training at a knucklehead gym. Right. And, you know, there's still a lot of that going on in MMA, unfortunately. But now, Lyoto's trying to knock Munoz out, and Munoz is going to try to knock Lyoto out. They probably submitted each other or attempted to submit each other full blast, but there's a big difference between that and this. Also, there's a big difference between sparring with big gloves on and shin pads and headgear and this. Tiny gloves, looking to kill. The Southpaw Machida stalking his play, you know. He has put a focus on being more active. He's been on the wrong side of some very close decisions and looking to avoid that by upping his output here tonight. Upping his output and trying to finish fights. And that's it! Expect a great show of respect from these two friends. The high kick from Lyoto Machida. Thankfully, it appears that Mark Munoz is okay, but welcome to the middleweight division, and Lyoto Machida. Beautiful restraint by Lyoto of not hitting his friend when he knew the fight was over. He hit him with that kick, went to do the punch afterwards and realized it was not necessary and stopped. And, you know, both of these guys look very much the part of individuals who are glad this is over. The move of the fight is brought to you by Metro PCS, now nationwide 4G LTE. Look at that. That's right through the glove. The guy, he had his hand up to block, and that's the kind of power that Machida carries, especially in the middleweight division. Right through the guard, through his hand, and look at that. Went to move in, saw that Munoz was out, and held back that punch before the referee got there. That is excellent sportsmanship. There's the kick. Munoz goes down. Now watch him move in for the kill and decided not to. That's sportsmanship, and I'm really glad he decided to do that. Well, if you think that's the best move of the night, probably a lot of you do. Tweet, let us know. The hashtag is Metro Move, and tune in to the UFC Post Fight Show on Fox Sports 2 for the winning move. Coming up next, you will hear from Lyoto Machida. As we continue live, it is UFC Fight Night from Manchester, England. We're back after this.